Hello, my fellow Freedom Builders, and welcome back to the channel. Now, lately, there is a topic that has gone completely viral, and that is the topic of TikTok investors. Now, if you don't know what that is, I'll get back to that in a second. But I can tell you that I have begun to wonder, am I really just a TikTok investor? Some of you might say no, some of you might uh, say yes, but uh, let's have a look at what a TikTok investor actually is. Now, I put in a little picture here saying, I see a stock going up and I buy it and I just uh, watch it until it stops going up and I sell it. And that is uh, a couple of investors on this TikTok channel called uh, Chad and Jenny discover momentum trading in a viral video. Now let's just have a look at it and I will uh, let you hear what they have to say in this little video clip. It's just about a minute and I'll comment on it on a second. So let me just start it up uh, and I'll let you hear it in the full length. It's just about yeah 58 seconds and uh, we'll take it from there. So how do we make money from home? For starters, this is not a sponsored video. We just get this question all the time, and honestly, the answer is really simple. So basically, I just trade stocks on an app called Robinhood, which I left a link in our bio if you want to check it out. It's free to download, free to sign up. They actually give you a free stock, so they're paying you to sign up. Um, but again, not sponsored. And I know trading sounds intimidating. Here's my strategy in a nutshell. I see a stock going up, and I buy it and I just watch it until it stops going up and then I sell it and I do that over and over and it pays for our whole lifestyle. Um, if you're wondering how much you can make doing this, in this month I turned about 400 into 14,000 and in this month I turned less than 1,000 into 20,000. And honestly, my favorite part about this isn't even the amount of money you can make, but just the fact that we don't have to go to a nine to five job. Yeah, we can focus on things that we actually enjoy doing. So if you have friends that like want to make money from home, you can tag them or send them a link. Or if you make money this way, share it in the comments so other people know like there's more people doing this now. All right, let's take a look at what they are actually saying. Well, first of all, there's something a bit funny about the video, but I'll get to the interesting part in, in the end of it. First of all, they say in the beginning, this is not a sponsored video, which is great. Then we know that. But then about four seconds later, they say, by the way, we use a, an app called Robinhood. I put a link in the description so that you can get this free stock or two free stocks or, or how much it is when you sign up. The funny thing is that that is an affiliate link. So when you use their link, it is true, you get into the Robinhood and you get one or two stocks or how many it is, but so do they. So if they could get 10,000 people to sign up for the Robinhood via a viral video like this, they are getting 10,000 times a stock as well. So they are making a ton of money on that. But that is the small part of it. It's not actually what I want to discuss here today. Now, what I want to discuss is <clears throat> that there have been made a lot of fun of this. It's all over the media about this guy with the cap saying, well, when I see a stock going up, I buy it. And when it stops going up, I sell it. And people are laughing at this particular little scene here. And I know it doesn't sound like he has this great strategy and so on, and he might not even have it. Then they show some completely random screen dumps and say, we made $14,000 last month and that is paying for our lifestyle and so on. I have a feeling that these are not really uh, that much into investment strategies and risk management and position sizing and all the stuff that I used to talk about because it is important if you want to be long-term profitable. However, what people are laughing of in this video is actually me, or maybe not me, but at least my strategy. Because what they mention here is so-called trend following. The way I invest is, I look at a stock, when I see a trend forming, I buy it. If it turns around right away, I have a stop loss and then I sell it. Or if it keeps going for 10 years and just keeps going up, then I hold it. That's pretty much how simple I invest. I know there are some small details and some rules and a lot of risk management and position sizing and so on in it. But the basics of it, they've gotten completely right. The funny thing is that that is what people, is, uh, what people all over the world are laughing about. When I see a stock going up, I buy it. And when a stock going up, I sell it. Let me just show you here 
As you know, if you have seen my videos about my, my swing trading strategy, I have these stocks that are now, they're a bit down the last couple of days, but since the 15th of September, they are up 145%. Now, how did I do that? Well, I found stocks that were in an uptrend, and then I bought it. And as you can see here, when they start going down, I sold it. So one here, I sold with a profit of 56%. Now, do I have 56% of all of them? No, I have one here at 5 and 11 and 7 and 6 and 0.7 and 23 and 15. But this one winner is paying for all the small losers. So it is about keeping the losers small. I have no idea how this guy in the TikTok video is doing this, but um, it, it is pretty much what I do. Then, of course, there are some stocks that keeps going up. Let's have a look at it. We have, for instance, MicroStrategy here. I bought that on the 3rd of November at uh, 171.5. And right now, as of yesterday at close, it is 502.46. Let's have a look at a chart to see it. Here it is. Well, what did I do? I have my uh, my trading rules, as you know. I'm looking at the RSI. I'm looking at the moving averages, a bit of volume, and a couple of different things. Uh, and in my normal long-term strategy, I also look at the weekly charts to make sure it is in a so-called green zone. But that is a total, totally another story here. But what I did was I bought it here, and that because it had been going up. Just as the fellow in the video said, when I see a stock going up, I buy it. And then when it stops going up, I sell it. So I bought it here and then it kept going up and up and up. And by now it's up more than 200%. And if it turns around and fulfills my, my sell criteria, I sell it maybe down here at 420 or something like that. And if it keeps going up to 100,000, I just keep it as long as it doesn't give me a sell signal. So the funny part is, as far as I can tell, that the thing people actually should be laughing about in all of these TikTok videos is their lack of risk management and their lack maybe of exit rules and so on. And the thing people are looking at is the thing that actually seems to work, at least for me. And uh, there are a, a lot of research showing for the last couple of hundred years that just buying things that already has gone up is actually a very decent strategy that keeps to beat the market. Then, of course, if we look at it, and I should say this is a Twitter uh, handle or Twitter name called TikTok Investors, uh, and this group, they are not really the investors. This group is just a group collecting all of these quite funny videos where most of them you can obviously hear they have absolutely no clue of what they're doing and they are trying to sell some sort of forex affiliate scam uh, it is you, you should have a look in there but a bit of a warning here you will eventually find yourself sitting for an hour or two just simply banging your head into the wall or the table just listening to these guys and girls because there is absolutely not much uh, content here that you should use for investing. But my take here was that the one that has gone completely viral is this couple, Jenny and what was his name up here, and uh, they are actually right. They're doing the right thing. As I've said, I would like to hear their complete strategy and how much they can allocate to each trade and how they pick the trade and so on, because I have a feeling that they might be trading a bit, but my feeling is they're actually making most of their money for their lifestyle simply on affiliates. And if you go viral like this, now this guy here, what was his name? I don't remember. Let's see here. It was uh, Chat. Uh, this guy has now uh, really trying to, to leverage this entire approach. And he's out having a, 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 a TikTok channel now where he's it's, it's called something like crappy investing advice or something like that. So he's really running with the flow. And he knows there's a ton of investors out there that thinks he is uh, quite funny and that his uh, fake investment statements are actually true. So he'll probably make a million or two dollars just from this affiliate thing. That's my uh, guess. But that's not really the point. The thing he's make a laughing stock uh, of is actually the thing that people should be listening to. Buying the stuff that is going up, of course you should have clear rules. 
and you should know your stop loss, you should know your risk, you should know all of this, but basically, buy the stuff that is going up, and when it stops going up, sell it. I know it doesn't sound complicated, and it is hard really to build your ego on when you're talking to your friends, and you have a stock that is up 200%, and you're saying, wow, you're a genius, how did you find that stock? And you have to tell them, well, it just went up, and I bought it. I know it sounds a lot more cool to sound like a, a financial advisor from uh, CNN or MSNBC or Bloomberg or something where you can talk 30 minutes about all the fundamentals. The basic is that things that go up tends to keep going up. I know there are market regimes where it is harder. There are more choppy market regimes. That is what I tell you about here on the channel. There's no holy grail. Absolutely not. But... If you don't have much time and you don't think that you're more clever than the rest of the analysts in the market, then pretty much follow the herd, follow the trend, and then you are pretty much better off than most of the professional funds. That's my take on it. Am I a TikTok investor? No, of course not. I'm not on TikTok and I probably never will, but uh, I can see myself in this guy, of course, without the cap and with some more rules and without uh, some sort of scammy affiliate scam. Um, so uh, that's about it. Follow the trend and you'll be good off. Look at the other uh, videos on this channel. I'll, g I'll give you my strategy completely for free. Look on the playlist called Learn My Strategy or something like that. It's all down there, all the rules, everything. And if you have any questions, just write me. I try to answer all the serious questions I get. That's all for now. Take care of yourself and your money out there, and I'll talk to you again shortly. Bye.